What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from What's Up in the Sky 37 or www.whatsupinthesky.com. Come check out the website. I've got everything I do up there, plus some uh, links to other people's stuff. I'm going to try and make it a little bit more easier to navigate all the old stuff since I have so much of the old stuff. But you're looking at something that another uh, one of my uh, subscribers sent to me, Dr. Long, sent me this picture that looks like an animal with a crested head. And we're going to take a good look at this because there's a couple of these it looks like in this picture. And it, by looking at the shadow, if we look, this is the head here and say this was the body. Um, you can see the crested shape head like a bird, some birds have, some things like that. This is an Opportunity Rover. This is a new Opportunity. The Opportunity Rover is still bringing back amazing stuff for us. Um, let's go check out. I'll show you exactly where we get it from. Here is the page you can get it from, and I always put this down below. So all you gotta do is check out the com, not the comments. I do this every time. Check out the description below, and it'll be right there. Just click it, um, along with some other links. If you have something to send me, my email address is there, my website, my Facebook page. Come say hi to me. Um, I keep that open for everybody. Just friend request me on Facebook. But like I said, the Opportunity Rover totally rocks. NASA has done a great job on this. Um, They've checked out the Victoria crater. They are that Victoria, like the thing is bad where you saw that Egyptian looking statue, all sorts of good stuff that's brought back. I just can't believe how much, you know, it's still going around there. And this was saw 3,392. It's been there 3,392 days. I must say, we got to give NASA some credit for that, especially that and the new rover. The new rover is awesome. Only thing I would say to the people that NASA watch my videos, I get a lot of hits from NASA.gov, and I don't know if you guys were laughing at me, but next rover, have little baby rovers that come off of it and can go explore. So if you want to go explore and you don't have to risk the whole mission of the rover, you can have something that, you know, if it can come back and dock again, so be it. And if it can't, maybe you have four of them under there, and, you know, you've got four shots that you lost, you know, have a couple little cameras on them. You know, you guys can do it. Come on. I know you guys got it. But let's take another look at this animal. Sorry, I'm just blabbing a little bit. And uh, to me, it looks like an animal. It doesn't look like a rock. It's, you know, it's black and white. And you know how that goes in black and white. It's kind of hard. Let me see if I can pull up Photoshop and get anything else out of it. Um, I didn't try this. Let me switch over to my mouse before. But we will surely see what happens here. All right. And if there's anything else in this picture. This picture has a lot of interesting things on it. Um... You know, just kind of neat, rocky area. The guy who sent it to me, Dr. Long, saw a couple more of these uh, these animals. He thought maybe around some of their offspring. There's also some interesting uh, rocks, like these the shiny, the shininess of it. I'm wondering if it's quartz or something like that. Um, but let's take a look at this thing. This is what really got me when I was looking at it. So I wonder if we can get it sharpened up at all or anything. Sharpen more. I don't do smart sharpen. I was using it a lot last time. Hmm. I don't like that. It brings it out a little bit, but okay, let's let's leave it without it. Let me see if it helps anything with the uh, exposure. Will help it. Just try and get it from the other and you look at this I mean we're looking at this area this is the shadow you know how shadows will change on the ground a little bit um, and that's just part of you know shadows whatever the terrain is so like you know, a lot of people say we didn't go to the moon because of shadows because the way they lay and stuff like that well I just know that when I'm looking at shadows outside they aren't perfect because of the land they lay differently but this seems to be a fairly typical rocky I mean it seems pretty flat for the area I mean there's some rocks there some rocky but not enough to make that happen see how it looks like it's crested there here's the shadow as it comes off um, and it comes up and bam right there so I would imagine that right here has the crested what he said would be head and it, I've never seen a rock that look like that but then again it very well could be but this also seems to look like if you go back to my last video pig on Mars it looks like that so let me try the uh, exposure real quick and then we'll let you guys go and I will move on to the next one. We got great subscribers here. You guys all rock. Thank you for sending these over. Um, everything you guys send just ends up being cool. I get so much stuff. Like I said, I'm gonna try and make you know, all these videos. I know if I just saw, sorry if I haven't gotten to yours yet. Um, I put out some of the cool ones. I, the ones I really think are cool are uh, the ones I'll do first and then go from there. But or if there's anything 
breaking. But this thing, I like to see. I'm gonna go back check see how many more uh, pictures I have with this object in it. Um, you know, because this thing does look like it. it's got maybe some ears or something. You can't see it in here, but by going off that shadow, um, that's what we've got. So much love. Let me know what you guys think down below. Comment. Hit the website up. Uh, hit subscribe if you're new. Check out the old videos. I think this is like video number 80 for Mars. I got moon stuff, UFO stuff. Uh, if you've ever seen, if you take pictures of UFOs, send them to me. I want to see some real stuff. I'm tired of seeing crap online. And you guys know those third phase guys, stuff like that. I'm just tired of seeing junk videos that look like they're made by crappy CGI students. So much love, guys. Take it easy.